Good morrow, nerds! This week on the LARP House, we are going to show you how to put Viking braids in your hair. I do Viking braids for several of my characters, but this week I am bringing in the help of local artist Nicole Larson, who can be found on Facebook as Red Rabbit Miniatures. Nicole is an amazing hairstylist who used to own Braids for Maids, a hair braiding business that still operates at Renaissance Pleasure Fair. She's a little bit camera shy, so I'm going to be doing the talking for this one, but the hands and the information are hers. Without further ado, let's do some Viking braids. We're going to start with wet hair because it's easier to work with and dry hair creates a lot of flyaways. The first step is to section off your hair. The top chunk of the sectioned off hair is what's not going to be braided. When you're sectioning off the hair, you want to angle the side sections so that the braids kind of go up and back so that they curve with the head properly. Before you start actually braiding, you want to anchor the hair with a smidgen of hair wax. This is called roughing it up, and that makes it easier to grab because the wet hair is so fine and clean. So what you're going to do here is basically a French braid with one twist. When you do a traditional French braid, you draw hair from the rest of your head on either side of the braid and bring it into the braid as you go down. For this braid, you are only going to draw hair from one side. This creates an exaggerated rope-like ridge. Nicole is drawing from the bottom. On shows like Vikings, they anchor Lagertha's elaborate braids down by sewing them with a special hair twine that you can buy at Sally's. But for our purposes, if you want, you can anchor them in place in the back with a bobby pin. If you're going to be LARPing, however, consider sewing them down for durability purposes. I did not sew them down, and this step is not entirely necessary and finish them off with tiny rubber bands that you can get at the pharmacy. Then you just do the same thing for the second row. So there you have it, my nerds. You are one glorious beard away from being ready to raid. I also love to rock that hairstyle in the muggle world when I'm feeling those murder vibes. You know the ones. Anyway, that's it for this week. Tune in next week for a kind of special episode in which you get up close and personal with me and how LARP cured my anxiety. If you like what you see and want to see more, please consider making a small pledge to us on our Patreon page because we really do depend on you guys. And there are pretty cool rewards for those who pledge a little bit more. Don't forget to check out our Etsy store. We are also on Tumblr, Instagram, and Facebook. Remember, like us, subscribe to us, fight with us.